The Ministry of Agriculture, Fisheries, Food Security and Rural Development partnered with the Taiwan Technical Mission to conduct a Dragon Fruit Training and Cultivation Workshop, a component of the second phase of the enhancement of the efficiency of the production distribution supply chain in the fruit and vegetable sector project, commonly known as the Seven Crops Project. The workshop offered farmers an opportunity to witness the process of using cuttings to establish dragon fruit trees. Ambassador of the Republic of China Taiwan to St. Lucia, His Excellency Peter Chaiyan Chen, emphasized that this hands on approach provides crucial insights into the proper techniques and best practices for cultivating this exotic fruit from initial stages to eventual harvest. The purpose we open up the workshop is to encourage more farmers to engage into the production of dragon fruit. Dragon fruit farming can be adapted to various climates and conditions, making it accessible to a wide range of farmers. Whether you have a small backyard or vast expanse of land, dragon fruit can be cultivated successfully with the right techniques. By promoting the benefit of growing and consuming dragon fruit, we hope more and more solutions will enjoy its health benefits and juicy flavor. This training workshop is an invaluable opportunity to learn from experts in the field, gain hands-on experience, and network with fellow enthusiasts. In line with the training offered during the workshop, farmers were also supplied with a comprehensive manual to support them on their agricultural journey. Minister for Agriculture, Fisheries, Food Security and Rural Development, Honorable Alfred Prosper, emphasized the significance of the collaboration between the two nations in advancing sustainable agriculture and enhancing the skill set of St. Lucian farmers. Minister Prosper expressed his gratitude to the government of Taiwan for their unwavering support and partnership in the agriculture sector. My fellow farmers, dragon fruit is one crop that has consistently attracted high prices, prices from buyers. It is no secret that dragon fruit is both highly desirable and expensive in our local market. Hotels and supermarkets, as we speak, data shows that the retail price of dragon fruit stands at $44.79 per kilogram. Can you imagine that? With its striking appearance, exotic flavor, and high market demand, this crop presents a golden opportunity to our agricultural sector. The demand for this delectable fruit is soaring, and it is our responsibility to seize this opportunity to benefit our farmers and boost our economy. Demonstrating a commitment to sustainable farming practices, knowledge sharing, and the continued growth of the agricultural industry, the Dragon Fruit Training and Cultivation Workshop marks another milestone in the ongoing efforts by the Ministry of Agriculture and the Taiwan Technical Mission to enhance the capacity of St. Lucian farmers and boost the agriculture sector. From the Communications Unit of the Ministry of Agriculture, I am Anisia Antoine reporting.